Hey fellow developer, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we dive deeper into a topic that often overlooked but incredibly powerful. JavaScript finalization registry. Whether you are a junior developer looking to understand the fundamental or an expert eager for advanced insight, you are in the right place. We are unravel the mystery of this essential JavaScript feature, exploring its application, benefits and best practice. So stay tuned as we unravel the secret of JavaScript finalization registry in a way that's crystal clear for everyone, from beginners to pro. So let's get started. <laughs> JavaScript memory management can be tricky, especially when it comes to handling objects that are no longer needed. As developers, we often need to deal with memory leak and other issues that arise from improper garbage collection. Fortunately, JavaScript has uh, introduced a new feature called the Finalization Registry that helps us manage memory more. To begin, let's uh, take a look at this simple example to understand how Finalization Registry works. A finalization registry is an object that enables you to register a callback function that will be invoked when an object is garbage collected. Here is a simple example. In this example, we create a new finalization registry and provide a callback function that logs a message when the, regis uh, the registered object is garbage collected. We uh, then create an object and register it with the registry. I create a simple example to understand how finalization registry works. In this web application, there is a simple set timeout that every set interval that every three seconds changes the object in the page and remove the previous one. And uh, this is handled using a finalization registry. So if I call the garbage collection, in this case, as you can see, the cleanup message appears. And this is how finalization registry works. Let's take a quick look also to the code base. In this case, there is a simple function called elements, elements that accept the DOM element where we have to mount the element. And then uh, the code creates a registry, in this case, the finalization registry. And the callback is very simple. There is a simple console log, and the console log has the message cleanup and the ID of the, the value. In this case, uh, the um, the create object, create a new LD element in the DOM, assign it an ID, a text object with the ID, append it to the element list, and register the, the element to the finalization. And also provide a simple log in the console. Then, using a simple set interval every three, uh, three seconds, we check if the ID is not zero. We get the element from the list and we remove it and we add a new element. This, uh, this happens every um, three, three, three seconds. When a gadget collector uh, need to clean the memory, uh, call the, the callback, in this case the finalization registry, uh, the callback we pass, we pass in the constructor and uh, execute the, the function for every object that is garbage collected. And in this case, uh, print a simple console log in the console. But uh, if you have to handle, I don't know, you have to remove something from the DOM or you have to, I don't know, stop an inter in in interval or a set timeout, you can do this in your finalization. And uh, as you can uh, see, this uh, API is powerful, but please don't abuse it, please. Why the finalization registry is a powerful tool for managing, managing memory, there are some important considerations to keep in mind. The timing of garbage collection is not guaranteed, and the callback function may not be invoked immediately after an object becomes unreachable. Finalization registry should not be used to manage critical resources, as it only provides as a best effort cleanup mechanism. The held values in the registry should not be used to access the register object, as it may prevent them from being garbage collected. 
Let's wrap on uh, our journey through JavaScript finalization registry. Remember, this powerful feature can help you manage resources and memory more efficiently in your JavaScript application. Wherever you are just starting out or have been in the development game for a while, understanding finalization registry is a significant step toward becoming a more proficient developer. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumb up and share it with your fellow developer. And if you have any question or idea for future topics, please leave them in the comments below. Thank you for joining me today and till next time, happy coding! Oh!